Hello everybody and welcome to the channel Crossing the Spiritual Streams. My name is Tandra and today we're doing our daily messages from Spirit and we have our three piles to choose from. We've got the number one pile with Adventurine, number two pile with Carnelian, and number three pile with the Amethyst Stone. Uh, remember, uh, it's best to go with your gut instinct on these. These are timeless readings, so whenever you run across them and feel compelled to watch, there should be a message there for you from Spirit. We have our messages as well as our oracle spheres, so you could be thinking of a yes or no type of question that you would like to get an answer to, and we would do those at the end of each reading as well. We're going to give you some time to reflect on the piles, and when you are ready, and you figured out which pile or piles that you would like to see, there will be timestamps in the description that will lead you directly to your pile. And we'll see you there. Hello, Pile One, and welcome to your daily messages from Spirit. You guys are the ones that chose the Adventurine here. We're going to put that off to the side. We have our daily messages as well as our Oracle Sphere, so don't forget to be thinking of your yes or no type of question that you can get your answer to. I would love to take just a quick time out just to say thank you so much for you guys who have left us comments in the comment sections, who have given our videos likes and thumbs ups, for those of you who have shared our channel with your friends and family, remember we have a unique URL. It is listed in the description. You can copy and paste it, put it out there on all your different social media accounts or share it with specific uh, friends and family members, you know, through text messaging or whatever, and let them know about our channel. That has been a great big help, and we just want to say thank you so much for those of you who have done those things for us. All right, let's see what our messages are today. We have the Page of Swords, we have the Strength card, and the Star card. All right. Oh, I forget. The hologram ones don't show up up there. <laughs> Move them down here. All right. <clears throat> the message I'm getting today is keep plugging away. Okay? <laughs> That's... I don't know how else to state it. That was just kind of the way it came through. Keep working at it. Keep going. Don't stop. You're on the right track. You're on the right path. Keep going. Okay? Um, you're finding the balance that you need. You're finding the right um, energy. Um, you, you have enough strength and enough uh, energy uh, to get through it and keep going and find the right balance. So um, that message is a little bit more vague and muddled than they normally are. Um, but I guess you guys will understand what it means when you hear it. So I'm going to just go with that. We have had lately a few piles that have um, stated that uh, people are trying to get through a rough situation and that they have enough strength to do it um, or that there is something that's requiring you to get past some obstacles and some other things like that and that um, you can do it or that your life requires some sort of balance. So we have been getting those types of readings and so maybe this one's in response to some of those um, and it's kind of a conglomeration of you know all of those energies but basically as you're on your way um, you, you know, keep going, keep plodding along, you're almost there kind of energy. So that's um, what Spirit kind of wanted you to know. So um, we're going to go with that message and we're going to run with it and hopefully it'll be something that you guys can do something with. All right, I'm going to move these cards off to the side a little bit so we can do our Oracle Spheres. All right, we have three different stands to choose from. We have black, blue, and green. And you go ahead and pick which stand you would like your answers to appear on. And you think of a yes or no type of question. And then we'll go through and we'll get our answers. All right. So here we go. Number one, black. 
today is a very likely. Number two blue is a probable. And a number three green is a not likely. All right, so we have number one black is a very likely. Number two blue is a probable. Number three green is a not likely. So there are your Oracle Sphere answers for today's reading. Please remember to give the video a thumbs up and leave us comments in the comment section. Don't forget to share the channel with your friends and family and check out our other videos. And we look forward to seeing you again in future videos. May the stars guide your path. Bye-bye. Hello, Pal 2, and welcome to your daily messages from Spirit, those of you that chose a carnelian stone. That off to the side. We have your daily messages here, as well as our oracle spheres. So you could be thinking of your yes or no question that you'd like to get an answer to, and we'll be doing those later on in the reading. I would like to just take a quick time out just to say thank you to everybody who has subscribed to the channel, left us comments in the comments section, liked our videos by giving them thumbs up, and by sharing the channel with their friends and family. All of you guys. We do have a unique link to YouTube. It is listed in our description, and if you copy and paste it, and you share it with your friends and family on social media, or through text messaging, or however you choose to do it, that's been very helpful to us, and we just want to say thank you to all of you who have done that. All right, let's take a look here, see what our messages are today. We have the King of Pentacles. We have the Eight of Wands. We have the Justice card and the Eight of Swords. Okay, interesting. Oh, I always forget. Sorry, guys. The holograms don't show up that way. Okay, you have two Eights here and the King of Pentacles. Now, I realize that the Eight of Swords is normally a... Um, not sure how to get out of a situation type of energy or feeling trapped or that kind of thing but it also can be uh, freedom and release and getting control and being able to um, face your fears or get out of things okay so it's not just uh, you know the the bound up part of the energy and what I'm getting here is with the Ace of Wands, or the Eight of Wands, sorry, and the Eight of Swords, is that you guys have a newfound freedom. Um, and the Justice card's kind of shown that as well, is that basically you feel more free to put your ideas out into the universe, to start manifesting some of the things that you want. Um, that feeling of oppression and um, being held down or being held back or uh, not knowing where to go next, that is starting to subside some. Uh, you finally have gotten some justice uh, in whatever way that that would have manifested itself. And that now you're more free to be able to pursue what you want to be able to. And I feel like this is going to... Um, be fulfilling for you. This is going to be, you're on your way to a journey of success, of being able to uh, reap the benefits and the rewards of what you've been putting out into the universe and what you've been doing. So, uh, you know, going through what you've went through, pushing uh, the way you have, uh, working your way through it, um, is now going to be paying off soon. It's going to be, um, it, you're heading in the right direction, basically. Um, this goes along with a few other readings we've had in the last uh, few days. Uh, so if you've happened to tap into those readings, this should flow right along with that. Um, so just letting you know that that's kind of the energy uh, that you're in right now. All right, let's take a look. And your oracle spheres, we'll move these off to the side and we're going to go ahead and get an answer to your question. You think of a yes or no type of question that has that kind of answer and then you pick which stand you would like your answer to appear on. We have black, blue, and green today. 
and we're going to go out and we're going to get our answers. All right. Number one, black is a probable. Number two, blue is a maybe. Number three, green is a very likely. All right. So number one, black is probable. Number two, blue is a maybe. And number three, green is a very likely. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching the video. We look forward to seeing you again in future videos. And may the stars guide your path. Bye-bye. Hello, Pal 3, and welcome to your daily messages from Spirit. Those of you that chose the amethyst stone here, we're going to move that over to the side. We have your daily messages as well as your oracle spheres, so don't forget to be thinking of your yes or no type of question that you can get an answer to. And I would like to just take a quick little time out to say thank you to everybody who has subscribed to the channel, who has left us comments in the comments section, who has left us thumbs up on our videos, and that has shared our videos with their friends and family. We do have a unique URL for YouTube that is in the description that you can copy and paste and that when you um, put it out there on your social media accounts or share it with your friends and family, that's been very, very useful to us and we just want to say thank you so much for doing that. All right, let's take a look and see what your messages are today. We have the Temperance card. Temperance has been showing up in a lot of readings. We have the Hanged Man, which is upside down. And we have the Knight of Wands. Okay. This message is very similar to another one we've had this week, but basically it is still important for um, you guys to get some sort of perspective on your life, get some sort of balance, get some sort of e an even keel type of, of um, energy is very important here. Um, I feel like some of you guys have maybe kind of running out half cocked or with less of a um, knowledge of what you're doing and you're just kind of running here, there, everywhere. You're kind of um, you're, you're letting your passions run away with you kind of thing. You're, you're, you're so excited about something or you're so um, frazzled maybe or just feel like there's just so many things to do here and there. And it's important for you guys to get some sort of grounding. That it's important for you uh, to get a, uh, maybe relax for just a moment, take some time out. Um, look at things from a different perspective um you know it's kind of funny um today's readings have been kind of mixtures of readings from prior um days this week and so i don't know if uh maybe different ones from different piles or, or watching these readings or what but basically there's some of you guys that have been in an energy of you've been working so hard on something or going out, running around so fast on something that it's important to take a minute just to rest or just to take a break or look at it from a different angle or um, get away from it for a minute. And there's some of you guys that have um, something in your life that's out of balance, that's out of whack, that... Um, is not quite as even as it should be that you're um, either working too hard or not getting enough uh, proper nutrition or you know, your food is out of whack or uh, that you've not been getting outside and in nature enough or you've not been getting enough rest or other things like that um, and that it's important to uh, get those things back in balance in your life. So um, those kind of energies have been flowing through and they flowed through to this particular reading is that it's important for you guys to look at things from a different perspective, take some time out uh, to rest and relax and uh, look, you know, start things anew and afresh afterwards um, and get things more on an even keel in your life and things like that. So that's kind of the message that's going on for today's reading. All right, let's go over and let's get your Oracle Spheres. 
answers. Basically, we have three stands here. We have black, blue, and green. You pick which stand you would like your answers to appear on. You think of a yes or no type of question that you would like an answer to, and then we will go out and get our answers. Ooh, something blew out here. All right, number one, black. Hmm, hard to get the answer today. All right, number one black is a not sure. Hmm, that's interesting. That might mean there's a lot playing out as to what the answer will be, depending on what, what happens next. All right, number two blue is a very likely. And then a number three green is a yes. All right, so number one, black is a not sure. Number two, blue is a very likely. And a number three, green is a yes. So there are your Oracle Sphere answers for today's reading. I hope there were some messages that were useful to you. I look forward to seeing you in future videos. Remember, we put out videos every single week besides these daily readings. And we do look forward to seeing you for those. And may the stars guide your path. Bye-bye.